guys, I just felt like I needed to stretch. I am going to get ready for work. I have an earlier shift today, much earlier. Like typically I go in at 9.45, I'm going in at 9.15, um, which I know is only 30 minutes, but like there's a lot that that person has to do. So I have to be like a game today. Also, since this is my Danny Diaries and I do confessionals with you guys all the time. I've been complaining about this week. Literally, I've yelled at cast members. I've stressed out to the point where I have lost it, which I haven't like cried on stage. Well, I mean, besides the other week, but that was just because I was having emotional issues. Um, it hasn't gotten that bad in a while. And I, I am trying very hard to be positive and to grab a hold of my anxiety. And I was doing very, very well. And the fact that I have stooped this far back upsets me. So today, I know it's going to be hard because it's going to be a Saturday, which means it's going to be even busier. I also know a lot of the regular Monday through Friday cast are not going to be there. So we're going to have a lot of weekender cast who may or may not have either been here or had a month's experience with the craziness that is the, I'm calling it hashtag concrete crazy. No, concrete confusion. Um, hashtag concrete confusion is what I'm going with as our hashtag. Um, I mean, it's even got it's gotten so bad to the point where entertainment, entertainment is, is literally working with us a hundred percent to do whatever they possibly can to help our job a little be excuse me a little easier. Which I mean, our entertainment cast are great to begin with, but I mean to the point where they're literally saying at the end of the show, "Hey, your strollers are parked over there." Yeah, um, which I never would have ever expected them to do. But um, I am determined to breathe whenever I start to get stressed. Um, if I have to do my little relaxation breathing exercises every show load, I will do it. Um, I am determined to, if I can, give myself a minute. Um, Yesterday I tried to, when I was Gates, who's kind of like the head honcho of loading outside and things happened so I wasn't able to, which of course only made matters worse. But after that point I did give myself an, a minute or two, because two, 120 seconds is not going to throw anyone off. Two minutes is not going to throw anyone off. If I say I just need a minute, give me one minute, no one's going to get upset. Same thing with managers. If a manager comes up and goes, why haven't we opened up? I just need a minute. Just give me 60 seconds. And they should understand. Should. Um, that or they'll take over for me and I can actually go have a minute to breathe. So I can afford to do that. I'm going to do that. I don't want to lose friends. These are, this, these are family. We have a lot of new cast that are coming in. And I don't want this to be how I'm looked at as this super stressed person. Um, because to be honest, I typically have a good handle on things that, and I've actually been informed that my managers all think that I would make an excellent trainer and are all for me. They're, we're all just waiting for my record card to clear up. So I need to prove to them that I definitely can be a trainer, that I can get a handle on things. So breaths I can do today. I can do today. It's my Friday. I get off earlier than I have been. I can do today. It's going to be a good day. I will see you guys after work. Fingers crossed today is better. Thank God it's my Friday. Hello, Mr. Frog. Hey guys, so back home. It is raining today. As I was telling Jared, I was like, I was texting him. I said, today wasn't horrible. But it wasn't much better than it has been. Um, against everyone's trying to help and trying to make it work, things still happen. Managers still made decisions that we all knew didn't work. We still had new casts that we had to, that hadn't been here all week and that we had to kind of like retrain on how to do it. And it was still a mess. Um... Luckily, we didn't have as many guest issues as we have had, um, because whenever something, a bad decision is made, we're able to, like, 
fix it almost immediately. Um, we did have kind of like a mess, mess up in the morning, but it wasn't like anything like that we hadn't had before. But like, it's just, I'm so glad that I have the next two days off. I'm seriously considering calling out, even though, yes, I know I shouldn't, but like my nerves, like, like coming home, I was thinking like, I've never had this many consistent days of coming home and just having like a crappy, just bad time and not wanting to go back into work the next day. Like I haven't had that happen in a really long time. The only reason I was determined to finish this week off was because this is the first five day week I've had in a really long time that was over 35 hours and I wanted to prove to myself that I can do it. Um, now I'm like, my nerves are just like shot and my anxiety just got so bad. And literally you ask any cast member this week, how this week went, they'd be like, it was okay. <laughs> like all of us are so ready for this to be over. And even the guests are, are, are over the concrete and it was just, They've completely taken over our little corner now. Um, like Fast Pass has very little space over there. Um, I don't know where they're moving after this. Supposedly, when they're finished here, they're moving. I think farther down. I want to say I hope they're not moving farther down towards our exit. I hope they go and do something else and give us a break. I don't know what I'm making for dinner because nothing that I have sounds appetizing. I thought about going to Deluxe and grabbing dinner to go, um, but I had chocolate cake today because it was someone's retirement, so I don't need any extra carbs, so I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm probably just going to look at the fridge and just come up with something. I don't know, but I'm so exhausted. Oh, I'm so glad we don't have anything planned tomorrow other than church. Um, Jared still hasn't heard all about his job but he is still in consideration um they will tell him if he gets the job part-time job or not or if it's going to be just an internship at sea world um supposedly it's not supposed to rain all day on monday so fingers crossed we will be able to go to volcano bay oh thank you all for sticking along with me and oh giving me encouragement i am so incredibly sleepy um I'm just going to rest and just enjoy the peace. It's one of those things where it's like I thoroughly and enjoy that I get to see Jared every morning and every evening. But now it's nice to have these evenings where he's not here and I can just kind of have a place all to myself and have it be a calm area. Anyway, I want to thank you all so much for watching. I will see you tomorrow. Hit the subscribe button, hit the bell icon, and I hope you guys have a lovely weekend. Bye-bye.